original hipster gyro. Original hipster from the spirals of time. Hi there, ladies and gentlemen. It's your buddy uh, Plastic Cactus here, ready to play some kind of game. Guaranteed fun. Promise you that. All right, what we got? What we got? Oh, Invisible Commander. No, it's Gith. Oh, it's just Gith. Uh, this hand is terrible. I can't keep this hand. What kind of moron would I be? I want to because I see all this mana and I'm like, oh, I'll draw into good stuff. But if one of those manas is not an island, I can't. Just can't. No, it's way better. Way better. Sending the dark steel up in the air. Perhaps on turn four. Yes, yeah, turn four. Three and dynamo and dark steel colossus. Sounds good. So don't kill Joyra. And we're gonna look awesome. We're gonna look so sexy. Me and Joy were looking sexy. Hey, it's Pascal. I guess Pascal, right? But Pascal. It's not how you spell Pascal. Eh, whatever. Maybe it is. Maybe it is now. This newfangled world. People are naming their kids all kinds of weird stuff. I was reading a book the other day. Uh, kid's name was Fargal. So, you know, it could be anything. If you could name your kid Fargal, then uh, you, you can name your kid Pascal, spelling it with a C-H. For show, for show. All right. So, I suspect Joyra's going to die. Hope she doesn't, but I suspect she shall. And I will need to draw another land before I can play Thran Dynamo and Dark Seal Glosses. It might be... Yep, dead. Dead. Murdered. Well, you understand, I had to try. So, we absolutely need to draw another land, or we are up Dick Creek uh, without a vagina. The Dragscape Zombies. Doesn't seem like a good card, but it did hit me a couple times, or will. An odd one. Um, okay. So, he takes creatures or artifacts from only my graveheart. Okay. Right, right, okay, okay. So don't let anything good get in my graveyard, is what you're telling me. Meanwhile, Git is gonna get me good. Really need that other land or I'm in trouble. It's not gonna do it. I will play the time bug, gladly. I won't even trade with the dregscape zombie if I can help it. Don't know if I can. Especially since he can just be like, mm, thanks for the joy retain bug, when he kills it. Not a good thing to have happen. Ah, the Cabal Coffers, and that's the end of that. Getting slam-baggled, slam-baggled, oh buddy boy. Hey now, hey now, the dream is not over. I will trade now. I will trade because I can spin into Myth the Gath if he decides to exile the Joy Time Bug. Mm, I mean, Joy Time Bug is good to have. Oh, maybe I just don't care. Mm, yeah, maybe I just don't care. The extra two damage. Can't be a big deal, right? I don't know, he is in black. He can just blast my face and gain some life with like one of eight spells. Oh, decisions, decisions. Oh, golly gee, golly gee. Yeah, I don't block with the time bug. It's a risk either way, but I feel like it's more of a risk this way. Time bug's so good when I actually have things in the stratosphere. And you know, uh, I haven't really used her all that often in this game. Is that all I want to do? How afraid of shenanigans am I? Nah, let's, let's ensure he doesn't draw anything good. So we will use it now. Uh, okay, these will go on the bottom. 
this go on the top. I don't care. You get the Infernal Tech Caretaker. Don't care. Not the card that I'm worried about at the moment. And then I go in with the time bug because we won't be blocking well established. So we have eight next turn. That sounds like Tamiyo territory knocking down the Cabal Coffers? Unless something crazier is played, which could happen. Or one, two, three, four. I could Joyra up a Dark Steel. That might be better. Let's see what he plays. Oh, I wonder what this is. Oh, golly, I just, I just can't tell. Oh, no, oh, no, oh, no. Yeah, I will Jora up the Dark Steel. That's better. Shwibby dibby 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 do. Shwibby do. Alright, so we're gonna take a few more damages. But I think that's okay. Take four more damage and then hopefully no more damage for the rest of the game. Sounds good if that's true. By all oh, only two more damage. By all means, go ahead and hit me. That's it, huh? Well, Schwip. No, I do not wish to add the time counter. Oh, you are suspended, Dark Steel. You are suspended, Flame Blast Dragon. <laughs> yes. But actually, we will Tamio, because she's lovely. Tap down the Cabal Coffers. Yeah, let's do the Cabal Coffers. I mean, he has a lot of mana already. That maybe wasn't the best. Uh, oh well. We'll see. Uh, let's stick up the Sphinx. We love you, Mrs. Joyra. All right. Chilling out again. So we do have a Dark Steel next turn. I imagine a board wipe, though, this is indestructible, so it'd have to be a pretty good fucking board wipe. Black Sun Zenith or something. Uh-oh. Tamio Killer? That's not good. Well, now part of me is thinking that I do trade with the Time Bug. I, you know, I block and then I do the Dark Steel thing. And, uh, that's that. Yeah, I think that might be the play. He can bring the Dragscape Zombie back with his Morph Creature, in theory. But I don't know if that's a huge deal. I don't know. If he goes for my face, I let him do it. If he goes for Tammy, I make the trade. That is the official decree. And the official decree is officially... Decreed. Oh, or well, unless this happens. Grave packed, baby, grave packed, oh ho. So, I do not do that. He can go ahead and hit me then. Two, four. Yeah, all right. Uh-huh. Yeah, do it. Hit her! Go ahead and hit her. Grave Pact. Well, now I'm thinking maybe I just wipe the board. I don't know. Yeah, let's do that. No. We wipe the board. Right now. One, two, three. 
that's not good. Let's do one, two, one, two. And then we have four land to do something with. All right. Cast. One, two, do it. Now Grave Pack doesn't trigger and everything's fine. And I've got a Dark Steel Colossus that comes down and is awesome. And is awesome. Always yield to be an awesome. And it also saves our Tamio's life for another turn anyway. Cool! That was a good move. I feel good about that one. And it looks like we chose wisely by keeping the blue up instead of the red. The next turn, we'll draw some cards with the Mold Drifter. Probably. Flame Blast Dragon might be a good choice, too. By the way, thanks for not using a Stone Sage deck. Uh. <laughs> oh, innocent blood. Stone Sage deck. I don't really know. Is that like some kind of super cool special... Well, there goes the Dragscape Zombie killing Tamiya. That's too bad. Uh, is that some kind of super cool special like Joyra combo? Maybe. I don't know about it, though. That's the end of Dragscape Zombie, though. So that's nice. And then we'll... I guess we'll play Flame Blast Dragon. Have a... Wing Condition on the board. Yeah, that's probably better. I mean, we'll see what I get, but that's probably better. Hey, Guild Lotus, actually. We can do... This. And this. Noise. And next turn, we've got the Flame Blast Dragon attacking. And the Sphinx comes down. Nope, that's not true. <laughs> Forget that. One more turn after that, then the Sphinx comes down. But we'll keep hitting him with big things, and hopefully it'll be all right. So he's got lots of uh, lots of mana stuff, but he only has one card in his hand. Soon to be two. For not using a Stone Stage deck. I'll be honest. If you are referring to some kind of poo combo. I am lost at the reference. Oh, so he drew a land. That's good. That's good. Stone Sage deck. I'll have to look that up later. Because I really have no idea what that means. Instead of bogging down the game, I could have just looked it up later and ignored the comment. But no, I had to start typing and, and initiate some explanation instead of just having the game go on. Why do I do these things? I'll pause it while he talks to me. All right, apparently it's just a really popular deck right now. Uh, that's all. <laughs> so, I haven't run into it yet. Um, okay, we leave Remand up. No, that's stupid. Look at all the mana he has. Instead, we'll just leave, uh, four or five. We'll leave five up. Yeah. Okay. Okay. I would. I would like to do this. Three, four, five. All right, cool. That's a, that's a hefty sum. Getting hit for an extra five. And then a uh, mole drifter. Sweet. Draw some cards. Now, I could have done that first, give myself more options. But I really want to get him down more before he draws into something good. So, it was a tactical decision on my part before you're, you're complaining in the combat. Uh, in the combats. In the comments about it. Uh, might not have been the best move, but I, I think all things considered, it was a, it was a fair move. And uh, it could, it could uh, 
lead to my eventual win. If I could kill him before he could draw something good, then I'll just win. Oh my god, are we actually going to be able to use the Sphinx Ambassador? Get the fuck out of town. Dang, mana screw. GG. All right. GG. And just in case it's some kind of silly thing, we're just going to blast him for full now. Always yield. We'll blast him for full face, and if that doesn't kill him, it'll be pretty damn close. It'll kill him, though. Yeah. Nice! Didn't even get to use my Sphinx Ambassador's ability. I never will! Alright, well that's the end of that, ladies and gentlemen. I'll see you next week for, I believe, the last week of Joyra. But I might be wrong. We'll see. 18 or 20 games, I haven't decided yet. She keeps it classic, standards are no-no She keeps it vintage as a matter of fact She thinks your music is just sorta of so-so She has a preference, but you've probably never heard of that Reject your disbelief, my friend Or better yet, why don't you suspend Original hipster Joyra Original hipster from the spirals of time Original hipster Joyra In just four turns she'll start a victory climb